Meghan Markle and Prince Harry did not disappear to an exotic island after their wedding but decided to postpone their honeymoon instead because of Prince William, a documentary claims. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have recently moved out of Kensington Palace, in preparation for the arrival of their baby, as Meghan is in the final month of her pregnancy. The split between the Cambridge and Sussex households was announced last year but Buckingham Palace officially confirmed the separation last week. While some royal sources have insisted the split between the families has nothing to do with a rift, others claim relations have cooled between the so-called Fab Four. More recently, reports have emerged suggesting the actual tension was between Harry and William, rather than Kate and Meghan as first thought. Royal author Katie Nichol claimed the brothers' issues stemmed from William, who urged some caution in a well-meaning brotherly fashion when Harry started getting serious with Meghan. According to 2018 documentary Harry and Meghan, the first 100 days, the couple delayed their honeymoon after their wedding because Prince William was tired of doing all the work. Royal author Duncan Larkham said, after the wedding, everyone sort of expected them to disappear off to some exotic island somewhere. But sadly for all the royal correspondents who would have been in hot pursuit, instead, they found themselves watching Meghan and Harry at Prince Charles' 70th birthday celebrations. Suggesting a reason behind the delay, journalist Helen Kieran Taylor noted, I think the reason poor Meghan has gone to work full-time is because Harry has got to pick up some of the slack. I think Prince William is tired of doing all the work. Kate Middleton and Prince William were noticeably absent during the garden party, which occurred in May. According to Daily Mirror photographer Ian Vogler, Meghan and Harry headed off for their honeymoon shortly after Prince Charles' 70th birthday party on May 22. Some reports say the pair flew out to Botswana, where the couple enjoyed their first ever holiday together back in 2016. Others suggested Namibia, however Prince Harry has since denied they visited the country in southwest Africa. While the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's holiday destination is still unclear, this month the couple reportedly enjoyed a baby moon at the five-star hotel Heckfield Place in Hampshire. According to The Sun, the couple stayed in the most expensive room which, for the price of £10,000 a night, includes two private terraces and a dining room.